Yeah. So this is Gaurav's pad. Yes, sir. This is where Gaurav and guitars. Gaurav and guitars. Yes. My so goodness. How many? So as you can see, one, two, three, four, five, and at ukulele. Ukulele, yes, sir. So Since I'm when? Ukulele, two couple of years. Couple of years, yes. Couple of years. Yeah. Hey, you all guys are really innovative, huh? your generation, I'll tell you. In yes, our sir. time, in our time, of course, uh, maybe I'm, I'm uh, denying you all the credit, but you have access to the net, to ideas, to, yeah, to spaces course, to that's, buy, that's to influences, which is a great thing when you all are using it to the full, no, in that sense. Yeah. At the most, we could only dream of a ukulele and not know <laughs> what it is. And So, introduce us. Yes. Alright, shall we? Yeah, go okay, ahead. So, this is my room, this is where I store all my magic instruments. Now, these are common instruments that most of you do know of. That is an acoustic guitar, which I painted myself by the way. I see. So, I used to have dreadlocks. That's Bob Marley's photo right there. <laughs> I used to have dreadlocks. Which used to we won't go into Bob Marley's singing in Konkani. Yes, that's no, a different no, debate. Yeah. <laughs> that's a different debate altogether. So, this was actually... A you case. had dreadlocks till recently, no? Yes, yeah, still recently. Just a couple of weeks back, in fact. Okay. Six years of dreadlocks, which I cut off right here in my room. Tra tragic? No, it was just, <laughs> it was just, just time. It was just time, I would say. So this is something I painted myself, and this was a, this guitar was actually a gift from a friend. He's he was going to Dubai, and he didn't really he had it, but he didn't really made play, way, so. made way. Uh, this is Granada. I think it's probably made in China. Yes. What's this the quality very, of Indian guitars? Do they make them? So there are a few. There is actually a dude who <coughs> makes guitars in Goa. Who? His name is Cloyward Menezes. He's as old as me. He's in the he's in South Goa, Agonda, I think. He's made an electric guitar and he's made a bass guitar already. Wow. So I'm going to interview him in a couple of I weeks. See. I'll share that video with I you. I see. So sure, really sure, brilliant sure. person. Interesting. So yeah, this is a bass guitar. This is actually my first instrument. I see. So you won't be able to hear it until I plug it in, but yeah. most people know what a bass yeah, guitar yeah, is. Of course. So it has some My so goodness. this is my first instrument. This is where all the madness started. All the madness is started with this one. Because, uh, see, I bought this and I wanted to know more and more about music because I felt I would not be able to do justice to this until I know more about music. That's why I bought acoustic guitar and this was given to me Then the ukulele then the other instruments just followed, you know. So this was an acoustic guitar. Now, people know about this one. This is a classical string. So I have a steel string guitar and a classical string guitar just to, you know. No covers, original, one original piece. Oh, you want an original? Sure, sir. Mm. Yeah, I can do this one. It's very trippy kind of music. Yeah. But no problem, fine, that's <laughs> fine. Your taste. Yes, it's called Ascending. So it's about going up there. I'll play a short version of yes. this. Yeah.
amazing amazing thank you sir so that's a sending that's beautiful, my own song beautiful to listen and even more lovely to watch thank you <laughs> thank you sir it's my own song so it's it's about 7 minutes but i can't obviously play the whole thing here but that was a short version of it just a Fine. few phrases that Fine. i could Fine. and it's mostly improvisation so it depends on where i'm sitting who i'm in front of so just waiting for an audience yes, waiting, waiting, waiting to be appreciated audience. lovely lovely yes sir that's that's the song that i wrote on this guitar it's, so that's ascending i've got more tracks transcending descending all of these tracks are there very trippy like i told you very nice very <laughs> nice very nice thank you sir only your rhythm so, music no probably covers. time yeah i mean yeah goa has too many covers as we were saying yes, you know, i think true. we need some originality you know that's true that's true and uh, so. push it and it's tougher it's tougher but it's uh, much more rewarding yes indeed ukulele yes uh, sorry electric sorry. one before electric, that so yeah. this is was this was one of the latest additions to my guitar collection i bought this during the lockdown in fact uh, just a couple of months after the lockdown somehow managed to sneak it in from so, uh, pedro fernandes I they see. managed to i called them up i said you know it's the lockdown i'm really freaking out at home i don't know what to do i want to new instrument. therapy you need therapy yes i need therapy and Musical said, therapy. Well, what do you need and uh, said we have some guitars you want to come check it out so i went i i saw the white one and i usually buy black guitars yeah but uh, i like this one for some reason and i said this is the one i have to pick it up this, so this is a major vice here yes sir 12000 <laughs> just like that <laughs> just like that again no i'm just joking i'm just joking you know i i think it's so important to believe in your dreams and in yes. your passion no and uh, one day one day you know it will take you places yes sir somebody told me that uh, you know if you keep buying instruments you'll be jack of all trades and master of none and i told them well i feel it really helps me to understand the other instruments yeah. the reason i can play the bass guitar well is because i bought this one the reason i can play this one well is because i have the bass guitar and the other instruments of that course, i have of course yeah, so i relate right. things that it's i so play right. on one then i try to play it on this one and it keeps helping me yeah. to develop my craft so i get better with this and that and that one helps the other to grow in that sense absolutely that's how music yeah. works at yeah. least yeah. everything me. works not that way in that sense like you know I guess if i do works. videos it's not that i become a worse print, print journalist or something it's a different dimension that correct time. correct so it's yeah. supporting it's like a ladder that you keep climbing with that's new true. instruments added to it all the time that's true that's true <laughs> so, fantastic fantastic yeah the electric guitar it's a fender strat fender square strat so yeah it's quite fender, nice fender fender Fender, yes. Fender is American. Fender is an American company, yes. So, yeah, this is. You got to take good care of it, no? I have to, yes. I clean them up, polish them every day. It's my thing. Oh my gosh. My favorite part. Then we have the ukulele here. Unusual design for it. Usually they have a circle hole. I see. This has stars and moon over there. See, from where is it? From where is it? This is an online order again, custom order. They were customizing things. They Which were. Which country? Ukraine. For some reason, tongue drum. This one came from Ukraine. It's just, amazing how creative those people there are, no? Very creative and dirt cheap. I If you see. buy a ukulele like this over here, three thousand to four thousand. This one with this design and everything, two thousand. I see. Including Good. the postage? Yes, and I had somebody coming from okay. there, so okay. Okay. that was good. But of course, if you play something, it, oh yeah. Uh, I would like to play a tune which is called the Gael. It's a Celtic tune. I like the Nordic, Celtic, Scottish people a lot and their music especially. So you are very global in your taste. We were talking about the Aztecs and we had a big discussion yes, about sir. it later. Yes, absolutely, but absolutely. What about that's great. I think we need a global vision, no? Yes, we do. We do. Take inspiration from different cultures. Yeah. That's what I feel. Usually people would play that's the four chords which you can make songs with but i don't sing and i don't like doing covers so Mr. Guy, it's a it's Last of the Mohicans the movie. It it was a soundtrack in that. It's actually a Celtic tune which. So I like a lot of folk tunes like even Indian folk classical music, Celtic classical music, Japanese classical music, Chinese classical wow. music, wow. Russian wow. classical wow. music. Akripovsky <laughs> is a great musician. So I basically listen to all of these things and then try to understand how they use it, how what are they playing, and then make a style of my own because you need inspiration from somewhere. 
right? So my inspiration is the world out there, yeah. everything and nature as well. There are so many sounds. What you are doing music. is really fantastic and fascinating in that sense. A few more left from the earlier yes. to, because we ran out of time yes. there. Yes, yes. So yeah, I think these and yeah, just. One more here. This is instruments coming out of your ears. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. This one I haven't opened it in a long time, but a very common instrument, so to say. The xylophone. Yeah, I yes. see. I see. So this one I, I got it from Pedro Fernandez again. I see. This was about four thousand. Wow. So spent a lot of my money on these <laughs> things. So. Wow, so that's with one hand, with one hand. Yes, with one hand. <laughs> you can do a lot with two also. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, that's a xylophone. Then, uh, yes. So these instruments, the, along with this, these will be the last few that I can show you. So this is a kalimba. That's a lot. Yes, sir. This is a kalimba. I've got a nice bag for it as well. So. Kalimba is Australian? African. 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 So. Yeah, it has these steel, steel tongues on it, basically, yeah. and this hollow body wood, so... Kalimba. This is African. Uh, there are bigger. There's a bigger brother of this, which is like same thing, but four times the size, called a Embira. So that's that's the one. This is the one I bought. This is three K. Again, it's a custom order online. This was from China though. I bought it from China. Long time back, a couple of years. This is seven thousand. It's a smaller, a smaller version of a Kalimba, but I it's see. seven thousand. It's because it's a branded one. This I is see. a gift from Dubai. So this sounds like this. Now what you can do, this is a resonator kalimba. So whatever surface you place it on, yeah. it will amplify the sound. So this is without the surface. Yeah. This is with the surface. My goodness. You can place it on a cupboard. <laughs> I won't place it on the mirror, but I will. It might just shatter the glass. It might just shatter the glass. But yes, you can place it on literally anything. <laughs> except for yourself, of course. I don't know. If you are, if you have an empty head, then perhaps it will make a sound. <laughs> but you can it's a resonator kalimba. So wherever I you see. place it, I see. it makes a beautiful sound. I see. So again, these are very nice instruments to just you know most people sit with their phones and you know they're always in their phones. So instead of that, you can sit with this wherever you want and make some music. <laughs> So the last three instruments that I would like to show you yeah. are these. Now these are called jaw harps. They are very much used in Indian classical music as well, Rajasthani music. They are also used in world music all over. They have uh, uh, origins in all the cultures in fact. So what is what this is is just a brass uh, yeah. see kind of cut out right. and it has this cut out here. So you have to place it between your lips. Okay. okay. And then you got you can use your mouth as a resonating chamber, basically. So So you can also make sounds with it by uh, pronouncing not pronouncing but just making the shape of a vowel in your mouth. So A E I O U, yeah, <laughs> English geeks. So you alternate between A E I O A E I O. Yeah. 
Wow, wow, wow. So, yeah, a bit of trance, you know, they, they use it for trance music I see, also. I Hippies see. in Arambol will probably tell you that I see. it's used for that. So, this is a jaw harp. Uh, this is the first one that I bought. And, that's uh, just the packaging? That's just the outer cover for okay. it. So that it doesn't break. Because it's a very delicate instrument. Okay. Not an instrument I would usually, you know, guitars and all you can okay. give to people, you can check yeah, it out. This yeah, one, yeah, I don't yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. This was 2000. Okay. This is uh, the recent one. This is a Russian Vargan. It's, it Vargan means jaw harp, basically. So it has this nice cover of a frog there. The toad. Okay, it's a bottle cock. So uh, my friend who sold this to me, gave this to me. And then it's made out of steel, complete steel. And uh, this one was 6000. Okay, so this is again the recent edition, just a couple of months back. So this you have to place on your teeth, not on your lips, so... So yeah, this, this is the Vargan from Russia and uh, this is another jaw harp, the last instrument for today which is just a bamboo cutout, yeah, you see this? From where? Uh, this I bought from Pedro Fernandez so uh, the origin they said they make this in indonesia i'm not really sure about that but i guess they do so it's nothing it's just a piece of wood but if you can control it now what i usually like to do is i like to add beatbox with this so like you can beatbox by saying like born to be clever to clever to be born so that's born to be clever to clever to be born then Lovely, lovely, and on that so high yes. note, we we'll we'll end for now, but yes. not before uh, thanking you so much for your time and thank sharing you, all that you have, and all the best to you. Thank it you will, so it much. It will sir. take you places one day. Thank you so sure. much, sir. Thank you so much.